everybody and uh, today got a little bit different job wearing a little different hat wearing my Virginia Yard Pros hat you can see the tractor in the background there so what's up today we've got this uh, homeowner that we're trying to help out here he uh, just had a new drain field put in and it's a uh, it's kind of rough so we're going to take and uh, we're going to use two implements or maybe three we're going to use the tiller to kind of go and loosen all the up uh, loosen up the dirt and then we're going to come back with our landscape rake and try to smooth it out. So anyway, I'm just going to show you what it looks like here. And uh, so we'll see before and then we'll see after. Okay, so you can see, uh, a lot of times it's hard to tell in the camera, but, you know, it's kind of uneven. Uh, you can really, it's really some spots over in here. So we're going to get this uh, tillered up and raked out and get it real smooth for him. All right, well, well let's get to work. So we'll see it from a little bit different angle. All in here, very ruddy, a lot of rocks. I said I was going to do a dag. I think it's a good time to do the camera. When you're doing this and you come up and see the different angles, you can see, see where your low spots are. So you have to keep kind of going all the way around to kind of see what you're doing.
All right, well, I think this angle should be able to see see the couple little humps right in here, roll, kind of a rolling uh, spot. And I'm just going to keep working on the diagonal right through here, try to get it as, uh, broke up as much as possible. That hump starts at about right here. So I'm trying to get it really good and loose right in this area. Like I said, it's dragging some of the dirt with it. See what the uh, landscape is right there. Hopefully, you can see that right there. Okay, so you can see here we're going to do a few more passes uh, with the tiller. Again, kind of pulling some of that dirt down from that upper section there. You can still see a little roll in there, um, but I don't know if I mentioned this before. He's just wanting to get it pretty smooth here for the winter uh, and then decide whether. Uh, when he's going to plant the grass on it. So it'll probably need some touch-up again. So it won't be the last time we'll be on it. And uh, in just a second here, we're going to be switching to the landscape rake. And I will say that I really like the combination of the tiller and the landscape rake uh, on a job like this. It uh, The tiller gets the dirt loose enough, goes down six or seven inches or whatever you want, and then the Landscape rake just helps fill in all of those low spots and, and gets it pretty smooth. So as you continue to watch this, you'll notice that it'll just get smoother and smoother and smoother. One thing that I did do that I didn't have video on this job is that I took a, a little time at the very end to, uh, to do circles. And um, when you do those circles, that really, that really does get it smooth. But anyway, that's, um, that's using the tiller and the landscape rake. So I think you'll agree. Uh, we left him in a lot better shape. Things are smooth. A lot of the rocks are out. I drug a lot of the rocks down here to the very end, on kind of on the right side of the screen, and sort of made a pile there for him to, uh, to be able to get that debris up. So, um, so that's it. That's that's what we were able to do for him. Well, thanks for watching, and like I always say, uh, if you enjoy these videos, uh, hit the like button and the subscribe button. Uh, it doesn't cost you anything to hit the subscribe button, and it means a whole lot to the channel. It uh, helps us to be able to rank better in the algorithm. So anyway, thanks again, and uh, we'll see you on the next video, and I uh, hope you have a blessed day. Take care.